about 3.30, we just got set up on this hillside. And uh, we're basically right on the bottom of it. We're out of the wind. I can hear the wind out behind us, and it's not bad uh, in here at all. So, uh, so hopefully hopefully they come off this hillside. There's a thicket up top that they bed in and work their way down and go out and grab a bite to eat. So I don't know. We'll see what happens. and uh, we had that little fox run by, it was pretty cool. And then my dad just uh, called me, said he shot a doe, so that's a good sign. Um, he shot a buck earlier in the year and I just shot my buck last week, so now we're out just to shoot some does and have some fun for the rest of the season. So uh, good for him and we still got a little over an hour left. So uh, hopefully that means they're moving over here and uh, we'll see what we see. We got about 15 minutes left and uh, it was a pretty good night. We saw six different deer and I'm guessing the does are finally an estrus around here because out of all six, I think uh, all of them were fawns and yearlings and uh, it stayed pretty windy pretty much throughout this whole night. But we got on the back side of this hill, which was good. We found a little shelter from the wind down in here and it wasn't really too bad. And you know, we had a, uh, some nasty weather yesterday, so I think these deer were up moving today and out feeding. So uh, they didn't really have a choice, but about 15 minutes left and uh, if we see anything else on moving around we'll get it on camera for you guys